Welcome to Drawfee, where we take dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Nathan. I'm Jacob. I'm Karina. And I'm Julia. And today's suggestion comes to us from Jacob. The biggest Drawfee fan of them all. Yeah. <laughs> Me. He watches every episode twice. Very personally, I watch it with, <laughs> with my voice and my actions. <laughs> Yes. Sometimes you watch them at like half speed just to really savor it. Yeah, I sit in the bathtub <laughs> and I watch them at half speed and I go, mm, Yeah. Mm. I text Jacob and I say, you want a game? And he says, I can't, I'm in the tub. And I know that means it's gonna be at least three yeah. hours. We all know what's the tub. Yeah, you know what it means. Um, Pokemon. <laughs> They've got types and... Sometimes artists say, what if they had different types? So like we're going from like a, a into a, a tall, skinny physique to like a muscular, are we like that? Sure. Like, like they're, like they like, they like the. <laughs> My type is dad. Like the lean. <laughs> they got like, like they got like elemental uh, types. Oh, that, yeah. Like the like they're typing. That's generally more what they're known for, <laughs> rather than the other stuff that you were saying. But um, if you want to give them a dad bod, <laughs> you know we can we can see what you come up with in your drawings. But we're doing a Pokemon type swap <laughs> challenge for the starter Pokemon for, specifically. For starter Pokemon specifically. And Jacob, you're up first. Yeah, give me a starter Pokemon. I'm gonna swap them. So I think for you, we're doing starter Pokemon. Let's start <laughs> with the number one starter Pokemon, the very first one. Bubby? Bubby Sore. Bubby Sore. I love Bubby. I love Bubby. He was my first Pokemon. One of the only uh, basic starting Pokemon that has dual typing. It is a grass poison type. I didn't know that. So. Is that when you like type on two different typewriters at the same time? No, it's when you are playing Yu-Gi-Oh and you're doing it like entirely through text chat. It's both. And you and have to write the card effects <laughs> manually every turn. And neither. Um, <laughs> so since Bulbasaur has two types, I'm giving you two types. All right, let's go. And I know you like these two types. Two oh, of them. Oh, it's gonna be my faves? I think these are your faves. Can you do for me, Jacob, Bulbasaur as a fighting dark type? Yeah, those are some of my faves. Those are your faves? I, well, I like fighting, <laughs> I like dark, and I like ghosts. My favorite shonen protagonists fight the dark all the time. Okay, so a dark fighting Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur. <laughs> it's hard to even imagine because Bulbasaur is so cute. Yeah, you can fight and be cute. Yeah, you can fight and be cute. You can I be do a little, it all the time. A little devious and be cute. Okay, I got, I got <laughs> an idea. I was just thinking of your your shiny Pangoro from your uh, your gym sonas, which is a a fighting dark type as well. Yes, I do love Pangoro. I like the fighty ones. They all look like hooligans. Yeah, I just kind of wanted to see what if Bulbasaur wasn't such a, a little goody two shoes. What if they were a little, <laughs> a little bit more of a rascal? Yeah. So I think I'm going to do sort of a, a oh, Bulbasaur he, that's he's, standing he's up. Standing up. God. He's evolving. <laughs> <laughs> and so he's going to be in sort of like a a fighting oh, pose. Oh, he's squaring up. Yeah. Bulb if Bulbasaur squared up. It might look a little something <laughs> like this. Hell yeah. People have been asking this question for decades. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Scientists <Yeah>. have wondered. <laughs> like, what would it look like? Is this bulb gonna not be a bulb, but a boxing glove now? <laughs> Just a boxing glove on its back? Yeah. yeah. That's fun. <laughs> I was thinking something along those lines. Okay. Uh -ho. Uh -ho. Um, but not, mm. not precisely like that. Okay, but along those lines. But along those lines. Oh my god! Once it reaches a bit of a bit of Venusaur. <laughs> a bit of dip, dip. <laughs> it's like that's the one, right? It's Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Venusaur. That is, is correct. Yeah. Correct. Thank you. I'm a genius. I know, <laughs> but. Yeah, it, it does go back onto all fours, but it does have an entire boxing ring on its oh, back. That, oh, <laughs> yeah. I love that. With, with two and boxers. then the babies fight in it. Yeah, there are two Bulbasaurs in the boxing ring just wailing on each other. <laughs> just grappling, grappling each other. Yeah. It's like, I don't know how this helps the Venusaur fight, 
but it is cool. It's that's just cool. That's retired. It's yeah. so when the camera goes behind the Pokemon and you're like thinking about the move that you want to do, you can you can just watch the, the two creatures fight on yes. all the swords back. It's strictly wait. for your entertainment as yeah. the player. It's, the um, back sprite's a nightmare. It's think, pay yeah. it's pay per view. So yeah. that's how you make your money. It's We're, sort of a money making Pokemon. We're gonna start going in that direction because I like that. Okay, so we've got some <laughs> little mini boxing ring. Yeah, on. There's, there's gonna be a little boxing ring on the oh. back. Oh. It's like oh my God. right now it looks like Death Stranding Bulbasaur. Yeah. <laughs> He's got a delivery for you. Well, it's then I punch. think instead of vines, it's got like like boxing glove, like punch tentacles. Oh, it's like a arms. Yeah, it's punch got tentacles. arms. It's sort of <laughs> yeah, you know, arms, punch tentacles. <laughs> what if it just had arms? Just like big arms. Oh, I meant like no. I meant like the video game arms. But what if it just had arms? What if what if, so so it's got a boxing ring out of which are just <laughs> growing human. It's Where do the arms, arms go later? What do you mean? Okay, you he got uses me there. He <laughs> <laughs> yeah. holds him up like a little prince. <laughs> oh no. It's kind of got the aesthetic of like, you know, the Rock'em Sock'em robot. Yeah. Uh, like ring with the, the arms. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Um, this makes sense. This, <laughs> you know, I, this is going places I wasn't expecting, but I don't hate it. Well, I you'd, do, you'd be wrong to hate it. I would love to throw a wrench into this. Okay. Where does the dark come in? Well, gee, I wasn't expected to be met with silence, <laughs> but I guess I make a great point. I, I okay. put a knife. <laughs> he's fighting a little. He's got a knife in the boxing glove. <laughs> <laughs> That's so he doesn't hurt his own hand with a knife. This isn't a steel type. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a dirty fighter. Yeah. Yeah. Fights dirty. Oh, he's scrappy. Oh, he, he's got like a black eye. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I feel bad for him. Well, he's like he loves it. He's like a little nasty scamp. He's like a yeah. He's like a fight boy. He's like a cage fighter, and got so <laughs> excited when a Pokemon trainer came to get him, and he was like, "Hell yeah, more fights!" <laughs> yeah, it just means more fights. Oh my god! And then the trainer just puts him into contests <laughs> <laughs> with like bows and little, no little dresses. <laughs> There's so much room in the boxing ring to fit all sorts of fun little accessories. Little, yeah, little bows and flowers, and you put a whole different little, kinds of gloves little back little there. Garden in there. Oh yeah, little fancy lacy yeah. gloves mm -hmm. over the boxing gloves. Elbow pads. Elbow pads. A hat. Oh, I think instead of like the. <laughs> Instead of the normal <laughs> markings, it's like a like a pow. Oh, like oh pow okay, cute. I sure. I like Jacob. I like this. This is this is good. Why does no one think this is good except I, Nathan? Answer me, Karina and Julia. Don't you think this is good? Why don't you think this is good? <laughs> I'm just thinking about bows. I just think like everyone headphones? who likes that idea should take this Bulbasaur and dress it up and then send it to us. Oh yeah, definitely um, dress up. Yeah. Dress up these Pokemon, draw their evolved forms. Yeah, that's just where I am mentally, sorry. Yeah. It's fine, yeah, Jacob. Well, <laughs> it's good. <laughs> this Bulbasaur takes the bows that you put on it and throws them at the enemy. And then they're like, wow, he's throwing bows. <laughs> Stupid. Trading uh, bows for it. bows. <laughs> bows is short for elbows. When you're throwing bows, you're flinging your elbows at people. Karina. Why would you shorten elbows? Because you're throwing bows. You're throwing bows. So you can lick them. <laughs> Julia, stop. Oh. <laughs> oh. Like a barbet. <laughs> I can't lick my elbow, but I can lick my bow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm glad I'm glad this is the direction we've we've gone. This episode is like a disaster so far. <laughs> no. It's a Pokemon episode. No. <laughs> I'm here. This Bulbasaur is good. I have a request. Yeah, what's up? Can you put a little band-aid over his knee? <gasps> yes. 
He's such a scrappy little, little guy. Scrappy friend. He came into this world already beat the fuck up. <laughs> that's so sad. And he emerges from the egg out. like this. Yeah. <laughs> he fought his way out of the egg. Yeah. Like sharks do. <laughs> this is good. I think this is this is him. Yeah. What else he needs? And maybe he's just like sort of I guess I could do like the thing where he'll be on like a patch of ground, oh, like you're fighting nice. him. Yeah. Oh, he needs like a new name. Oh yeah. Uh, that isn't Bulbasaur. Boxasaur. Boxasaur is better than Palbasaur. <laughs> Sorry, Julia. What if it's wow. <laughs> What if it's Bulbasaur and it's sore like Oh, like you're sore from getting beat up. What the fuck's yeah. a bulb? Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Unsay that right now. Bruzasaur. <laughs> Bruzasaur. I kinda like. Bulbapal. <laughs> you kept the bulb again. That's the problem we're having. Pow ba ba pow. Pow ba ba bul ba boom. Pow, his name is Pow ba ba bul ba boom. That's his full name. Pick your starter, Pow ba ba bul ba boom, today. I love that anime. <laughs> We I'm done. Two Yay. more to go. I don't want to draw anymore. We're already <laughs> in such a good place. I'm going to be exhausted by the time it gets to me. <laughs> Karina, you draw now. Fine. I wanted to continue with the dual typing theme. Oh. Uh. Um, and so the only, as far as I know, and I'm sure people will correct me if I'm wrong, but as far as I know, the only basic starters that are dual type are Bulbasaur and Rowlet. So we're we're getting an evolution in here. What? We're gonna get uh, it's a it's still from a starting Pokemon, but it's the evolved form of a starting Pokemon. Mm -hmm. So we're going to Alola. We're going Gen Seven. I would like you to draw for me Incineroar, <gasps> oh. originally a dark fire type. I would like you to make it an electric fairy type. Please. Bro. Oh. You want me to draw a buff cat? I want you to draw a buff <laughs> electric. You fairy shouldn't cat. have. It's just like a gift. I tried to pick ones that y'all would enjoy. Okay. That was my that was my hope as the host of this episode. Yeah, I feel like you really it just shows how you know us that you're giving us these. You know what we want. I know so what you want. I know what the audience wants. episode today where I felt incredibly predictable. <laughs> I have an Incineroar. He's a shiny Incineroar and his name is Skimbleshank. Because <laughs> I couldn't fit the last S in and I thought it fit anyway. <laughs> I mean, you know, if you had asked me to guess what your shiny Incineroar's name would be, that's probably what I would have guessed. It, would, it should have been high on your list. Yeah, it would definitely be <laughs> up the there. Is the point. J Jason Derulo may have been up <laughs> there too. <laughs> <laughs> I, I was trying to learn how to play him in Smash too, because I think he's so cute, but like... That's hard. Yeah, I, tried I can't. Also. I can't play him on any level that in uh, has platforms. <laughs> yeah, you just dive straight off the edge and die. That's like yeah. what I kept doing. Yeah, it's really hard, and I'm not. I'm already not good at Smash. But his except his for Mr. Hits Game are so chunky. They yeah. feel so you, like you'll hit maybe once per match, but it'll feel real thick. Yeah, the hit the thick hits are so nice. Oh, I thought you said hips. Those hips. <laughs> those hips those and two. those hips. <laughs> <laughs> okay, electric fairy. Yeah. What an interesting. Are there any electric fairy Pokemon? Uh, I believe Deden. Oh, right. <laughs> Pikachu. <laughs> Pikachu. Deden, a.k.a. Round Pikachu. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, exactly. As soon as you said Deden, my brain was like, I know that's a Pokemon, but I don't remember which one it is. It's one of the is, Pikachus. That name describes nothing to me. It's round Pikachu, but not quite as round Pikachu as Toga Demaru. That's, that's right. That's the roundest that's Pikachu. That's the roundest Pikachu. Oh. I really like that <laughs> movie. Yeah. Uh -huh. but I found the sci-fi part a little confusing. It's the one with Tom Cruise. To Are you making an Edge of Tomorrow joke? Yeah. Out of Toga Demaru? <laughs> <laughs> it's a reach, but okay. The way that Nathan said it, I had the same beat, so it's Edge of Tomorrow. <laughs> oh, 
right. <laughs> hey, kids, let's go see Toki Tomaru. The Tom de Cruz and Toki Tomaru. Tom de Cruz. Tom de Cruz. Dad, stop. <laughs> Dad, you're being weird just again. Say the, just say the title of the movie <laughs> right or stop don't. Stop it to what? What do you mean? Dab it to Get in the car. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to movies. Top of the cruise, I'm a blunt. <laughs> Dad, no. <laughs> aliens. <laughs> Oh God! Uh, you're ruining my birthday, Dad. <laughs> Happy <to> birthday! <laughs> you told me we were going to build a bear. Build, build a bear. <laughs> build a bear after the movie. <laughs> oh God. I'm losing it. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, <laughs> see, thank you, Julia. That was a gift. That yeah. You're welcome. Us. <laughs> we just had to cruise. We had to get there. It was a little workshop in a little scavenger hunt. But once we got there, it was it was a beautiful gift. Yeah, you shot for the moon, and and we missed, but we did land among the stars. Wow. I set it up, and and y'all whiffed. <laughs> and I whiffed, but we dunked ourselves. <laughs> oh. oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> oh. Oh, I'm going to uh. need a nap. <laughs> Can I go to bed? <laughs> How do I make this fairy? I don't know what that means. I feel like the fairy typing is one of the least... Like clear to me it's aesthetically. Like, it's, I feel like it's like the cute type. Yeah. yeah. It can be cute or sort of majestic. What about <laughs> Grim Snarl though? Yeah, yeah. Grim Snarl's a fairy Grim type. Grim Snarl's yeah. a nasty fairy. And you not can, one I would ever call beautiful you can have or nasty majestic. Fairies. You yeah. can absolutely I'm have go a nasty fairy. I'm trying fairy. to go nasty fairy with this. Fairies are like pranksters. Yeah. Definitely getting the electric already from the brows, which I love. Thank you. That's That was it. That was the point. Yeah. Let's get prankster is a, on the cleave. An ability that Grim Snarl can have. Yes, Nathan. We get it. You play Pokemon. <laughs> <laughs> we also play Pokemon, but not like you. Yeah. <laughs> I play it worse. You play it worse. I play it a less fun way. Yeah. <laughs> One of those guys. I don't at all. That's the least fun way to play it. Yeah. Is not at all. It's, yeah, I think, I like tied that. with my way for least fun. <laughs> I mean, I'd argue that I'm not. I, I, I stopped playing it the fun way the second I got into shiny breeding. <laughs> if it's fun for you, then it's the fun way. The thing is, it's not. <laughs> <laughs> it fun... Do you know how long it took me to get Skimbleshank? How long? Like, not the longest shiny I've done, but it took like almost 800 eggs. That's a lot of eggs. That's a lot of eggs. Yep. <laughs> yes, it was. <laughs> but now yeah. you have him. I do. And Julia, that can't be taken away from you. Did you know that there were so many eggs in Pokemon? Yeah. yeah no. Maybe, maybe that'll draw you towards the next <laughs> There's a game. lot of you eggs, especially eggs. if you play it the way I do. <laughs> the egg way. You're not going to like how many eggs it took me to get a shiny Rowlet. <laughs> 10,000 eggs. Okay, luckily not that many. 2,000 eggs. Not quite. 1,500 <laughs> eggs. You're almost there. One dollar, Bob. 1,600 eggs. You're almost there in the other way. 1,550 eggs. Oh my God. It took me 1,100 eggs. Oh. Almost 12. That's a lot of eggs. Yeah. Uh, I, I was closest you gotta, without going over. So you gotta make, you gotta break a few eggs to make uh, yeah. the, a few Pokemon. Yeah, exactly. Somewhere in the ballpark of 1,100. Is Rassle Belt's a butterfly? I think that's what fairy types be like. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Now this guy would win the the contests. Yeah. Oh yeah. This... And could hang out in the boxing arena. Yeah. Could do it all. I remember playing. Um, are very soft. What's the one that has Swampert in it? Uh, Ruby. Ruby. Ruby Sapphire. Hoen. Yeah. Hoen. <laughs> I remember playing <laughs> that, and I kept 
I had Swampert and I kept putting him in all the contests for like beauty and cute. And he kept winning and just seeing him on the stage. <laughs> <laughs> Swampert's so ugly. I refuse I have to, to evolve my whatchamacallit, Marsh Stomp. I was just like, no. no. I don't want you to turn ugly. Same with my, uh, fuck, what was his name? Baneri. I was like, you will not evolve into a whore. Wow. <laughs> You'll be my little Pokemon forever. Yeah. Yeah, Swampert up on stage and the judges are just like going nuts. And I'm like, what is happening? <laughs> Swampert is beautiful. Mm. <laughs> he's a he's a big boy. <laughs> Why does Swampert's head look like a toaster? Because <laughs> God hates him. Yeah. <laughs> can I um can I tell you guys something? Yeah. Yeah. Not a bit. Swampert is the Pokemon I had chosen for Julia to draw. Oh no! <laughs> well, I mean, well, does can, it matter? Can do I can it, still yeah. do yeah, it. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm just, I'm glad we organically brought up Swampert. <laughs> yeah, to roast it. Because yeah, I had to get a fire, yeah. grass, and a water. It's on you to make Swampert good, Julia. <laughs> yeah, fix Swampert, I think, please. For me, I I'm, think the the typing that I've chosen for you to give to Swampert is gonna be a lot of fun. Okay. You know. I think Swampert's beautiful in their own way. In a toaster way. In sort of a toast, in sort of a thick Son toaster. Of a Texas toast. Axolotl. In just sort of like an ugly, unappealing <laughs> sort of way. Yeah. Swampert is beautiful. <laughs> if you judge it on those metrics. <laughs> well, it's like when you look at a Texas toast and you're like, that's too much bread. But then you put butter and, and garlic on there and you're like, mm, mm. beautiful. So you want to eat Swampert. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, if it means I don't have to look at him anymore. <laughs> it's like those, you know, what? it's like those philosophers that really hated the Eiffel Tower. So what they did was that they bought uh, that like their the place that they would eat most commonly was in the Eiffel Tower because you didn't have to look at it anymore. Damn, because the only place in Paris yes. where you couldn't see the Eiffel Tower was when you were in it. That's wow. like that's like that's that's my method with Swampert. Yeah, you got to be inside Swamp. <laughs> <laughs> the Swampert has to be in my belly. Wait. Oh, yeah. You eat. I yeah. eat Swampert. You eat Swampert. Yeah. yeah. I eat Swampert. I eat Swampert. <laughs> Mom. <laughs> Swampert. I got a big heart on his chest. Yes. 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 Oh, wow. Well, well, mm. Oh, it's like a defibrillator because it's electric with a heart. Oh, my God. That's not what I was thinking at all. That's kind of cute, though. I was yeah, thinking of just cute. making it into like a full shirt. Like a, oh, like a, like, like a boob window. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah boob window. Yeah. I want him to be so extra. He's one of them buff healers. Yes. <laughs> He's a defibrillator. <laughs> yes. It kind of makes sense. I love the way you, you made the fire belt an electric belt. That yeah. That's good with a little butterfly. We give him two tails because that means he's more magical. Yeah, that's true. That's just facts. that's how tails work. That's how tail work <laughs> from Sonic. Yeah, yeah. This is cool. Yeah, Thank I like you. this. I'm excited to see the color on this when you yeah when you put it on. Of course, but it's gonna look nice. Yeah, I did. I did pick electric before I picked anything else for Karina because I knew I wanted. To see them, <laughs> them cool lightning effects in the render. God yeah. Damn. Now I have to do it. Yeah, you do. <laughs> Lovingly render. It was a gift for me too, <laughs> this choice. See, he's one of those ones where he's just like, he looks scary and big, but he's super nice and he's a healer. And two oh. feet tall. <laughs> Yeah. He's two feet tall. He's two feet tall. <laughs> <laughs> like Pikachu is over here. <laughs> like, what are you doing, bro? Oh, Dude. <laughs> it's that, it's that Pikachu face. <laughs> <laughs> no. Like a little action figure. <laughs> no, he's massive. He's huge. Oh. Don't you worry. Okay. <laughs> I love a little scenario. worried. Yeah, he he typically is defensive and has a lot of like support and healing. Like he's for doubles. Oh, for but sure. But if he needs to like fight, then he just smothers the other pogies with his chest. <laughs> 
the last thing you see is Why? just a heart <laughs> coming towards you. Yeah. <laughs> it's a... It's a the despicable man from Skate Infinity. <laughs> it's his love hug. <laughs> yeah. It's coming at you. Yeah. Watch out. Wow. I'm actually going to scooch this Skate a bit. Skate the Infinity reference. Yeah. It's We've what, been watching it's it. What, it's what the people wanted, I, yeah. I bet. <laughs> Everybody watch Skate Somebody the Infinity, yeah. at least until you get to the love hug part, so you know what we're talking about. Yeah, it's important. It's very good. <laughs> it's uh, it's very devious. <laughs> Okay, here here you go, furries. You get this one on the house. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta start discussing the name. Oh, and yeah. And I'm thinking there's something with like, instead of Encina, we could go with like Sparkle or Sparka something. Mm. Cause like Sparkle and Spark are both lightning and sparkly fairy terms. That's true. Like Sparkle Spark. Roar. Sparkle Roar. <laughs> sparkle Rar. Sparkle Rar. Sparkle Rar. Yes. XD. Sparkle Rar XD. <laughs> there it is. Now I got to make him look like a sparkle dog. I got you. I got you, internet. <laughs> <laughs> this rules. Awesome job. Thank you for giving me Incineroar. <laughs> Time to ruin Julia's life with Swampert. Yep. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> we spoiled this one, but you know, it just, it, sometimes a Pokemon is so iconic that it gets brought up anyways, which, you know, that's. Not not one I'd classify Swampert as. Well, it's the Who brings form. up Swampert? Y'all did. Y'all brought up Swampert. <laughs> to, to freaking rag on yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> to well, shit directly into his mouth. <laughs> the uh, the evolved form of, uh, or the final evolution of Mudkip. One of the cutest starters. Yeah. Becomes yeah. this. An ancient meme. <laughs> Honestly, it's what Mudkip deserves after the irreparable damage it did to the internet in yeah, like the true. late 2000s. <laughs> what type am I making him? I would like for you, please, to make uh, the Swampert, a dragon ghost type. Yes. Oh, I feel like that kind of becomes like dreep, dreepy or dweepy. What's the one? Dweepy. Is that correct? Dreepy. dreepy. I was thinking specifically <laughs> of Giratina, the Pokemon devil. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> Satan. Some Pokemon Satan. <laughs> the Lord of uh, the Distortion zone or whatever it's called whatever the I, fuck i didn't play diamond and pearl but i'm gonna play the wow. new one i'm gonna play the the new one when it come out oh my god we should play that together let's all play it together we should do more of the whatchamacalls it gaming the yeah but the one with the cave and the big pokies and i would do more of that. oh that was max fun. raid adventures yeah yeah those are fun <laughs> those yeah. are fun by the time you've heard this episode, we've done more of that. Yeah, and you wouldn't even know. And you wouldn't even know. That's how does how it feel? <laughs> I like I like this approach. Starting with some drips. This kind of yeah. looks so far like the snaily one. The snaily ones. The sluggy, sluggy snaily one. Goomy. Goomy. And uh sligoo. <laughs> Is that what it's called? <laughs> I don't remember. Sligu? Sluts. What's it called, Nathan? Gumi. Gumi and then what? Gudra. Gudra. No, there's a middle one. Oh. Sligu. Sligma. Sligma. You're right. Sligma. It's Sligu? It is Sligu. Such a stupid name. That's correct. You were correct. No one likes Sligu. That's, I I fully wiped Sligu from my memory. I so only I know it went Gumi Gudra. I only I know because I um, Sligu in my brain. My I only brain know refused. because I had got I bred a shiny Gumi. Shiny Gumi. And it hatched on the day we got laid off. Wow. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it was all worth it. <laughs> yeah, it was a it was a good omen. Yeah, really. Yeah, a good omen. Good yeah. Omen. And he's <laughs> good so omen. cute, and he's yellow, and his name is Pom Pom Purin. Yeah. I think we've brought shiny Gumi energy to the channel from that point yeah. forward. Let's imbue this video with the shiny energy. Hey, you. I hope if you're shiny breeding right now, you get it. 
Yep. You're, you're going to get it before this episode is done. Yeah. Good on you for having something else going on while you're shiny breeding. Definitely want to multitask that. Yeah. Um, I only shiny breed when I'm stressed. You know, if this video <laughs> isn't long enough to get you all the way through the shiny breeding, we got a, a yeah. whole backlog you can check out, plus uh, all of our stream VODs over on uh, Drawfee Extra. Yeah. That's so, true. Uh, I do know from experience that it does take about a week to breed 1,100 eggs. So. <laughs> You can also watch this at half speed in the bathtub. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh, you should definitely do your if, shiny breeding in the bathtub. <laughs> if you're feeling really wild, just slow it down so that it lasts 24 hours. Ooh. 24 hour oh, drawfee. Yeah. Like drone drawfee. <laughs> mm. oh. <laughs> mm. <laughs> that's kind of what it would sound that's kind like. Of, that's I bet what it yeah. would sound like, and that part probably sounds even crazier, <laughs> even slower, even yeah. slower than that. Resonant, resonant. I realized that I was thinking of Mega Swampert when I was oh. defending Swampert's appearance. No, no, no. You, you got the, the correct fuck? one up. Oh, Mega he's jacked. Yeah, that's Swamp that's what I was thinking yard. of when you were like, you could call that guy ugly. Mega Swamper is just Jack Swamper. Yeah, yeah. He'll kick your ass. I will say that they it is an improvement in that he's just like round and meaty. Yeah, yeah. which is very cute. Regular Swamper is you know he's, he's he's trying his best. You don't know that. <laughs> Sometimes your best isn't good enough. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's just a fact. <laughs> but he's still, you know, he's still doing it. You gotta have some sympathy. Hey, hey you <laughs> in the comment. <laughs> You're about to defend Swampert. I don't care. <laughs> You'll never change my mind. I tried. I cried for three days when I had to evolve my marsh dog. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, Probably. I, I tried everybody. There's nothing you can say that I haven't tried. <laughs> yeah, Nathan does this every week and we're just like, Nathan, Nathan we'll stop. never like Swampert. Stop. Like I'm gonna put I'm gonna make Julia draw him. That that'll make oh. you like him. Oh my. <laughs> I mean, this one's really creepy looking so this far. Is very does it have an eye in its mouth? No, it's a little flame. Oh, <gasps> Because it's like a, I wanted to be ghosty, ghosty like a lantern, like a yeah. ghosty lantern. But then he's also a dragon, so he's got Lanterp. the Lanterp. Lanterp. <laughs> he's Lanterp. <laughs> Lanterp. <laughs> yep. <laughs> that's. I mean, that's it. We, yeah, okay. we got there. Oh. See, at least this one you're drawing like leans fully into being nasty. Yeah. yeah. I, I feel like that's, that's Swampert's problem. Yeah, that's why he, he just needed a little bit. He needed to get off the fence. Yeah. Yeah. It's like just, be cute or be nasty. You can't be both. You can't be both. I'm sorry. Sorry, bud. I that, mean, in a general sense, you can, but not Swampert. Not Swampert, yeah. <laughs> it, it works for some yeah, people. Some, for some, some people Pokemon, can pull it off. Not Swampert. Not Swampert. Swampert is... <laughs> this is the Swampert 8 episode. <laughs> Jeez, I didn't... I wasn't ready I wasn't he's ready just to one of those so ones. Mean. Like he's I said, just, it's yeah. it's him and La Punny. I'm just like, <laughs> why? Why this? My beloved babies. I was so upset when I evolved uh I always forget his name because he was nicknamed Masosa in my game. And I just uh, I was so sad. <laughs> Maso <Could> sad. <laughs> Maso I was Maso sad. <laughs> <laughs> I actually anyone who knows that reference, good for you. I'm gonna say it. I don't actually hate Swampert that much. When I had one in my game, I thought it was fine. I just thought it was really funny that it kept winning kept beauty winning competitions. The beauty contests. I did not like. Like I said, I held my Marsh Stomp back from evolving for an extended period of time just because I didn't want him to be ugly. <laughs> but I also do love to curate my Pokemon teams to themes and strict aesthetics. So I guess that's a personal problem. Yeah, that's the beautiful thing about Pokemon is you can you can just sort of make it, you can make your team whatever you want. You yeah. can go for like the power gaming 
style you can just go for aesthetics oh my god of course that's the first thing you'd list <laughs> when i played soul silver all of my pokemon were named after state capitals oh wow except for my umbreon which was named after landon donovan because they both have big foreheads who's landon donovan he was a player on the u.s men's soccer team wow. <laughs> yep wow. with a big forehead <laughs> <laughs> damn call out Landon sorry, Donovan call Landon out post. Donovan, I'm sorry. It was funny. <laughs> I mean, having a big forehead's probably great for soccer. You can really get the ball <laughs> yeah. far yeah. out of area with your head. I think I have a pretty average size forehead and I was always too scared to do headers. Yeah. I was afraid I'd just bash myself in the face and break my glasses again. Like a nerd. <laughs> And you'd I'd, be like, oh, my glasses. I did Scramble have sports around. glasses, and those wouldn't break, but I'd argue they would hurt way more I when did, you get bashed in the face. During a soccer game <laughs> that I played, this girl had those sports glasses on, and uh, the ball went up into her face, and the sports glasses cut into her, her eyebrow. Oh, my God. Why and is she, youth soccer like so dangerous? <laughs> Why did we do that? <laughs> I don't know. I was goalie, which is the worst position. Be Bruh. If you want to stay safe. Yeah, I was defense and I had like the sports glasses. And one time a girl took a penalty kick directly into my face from like four feet away. Yeah. That shit hurt. Yeah. <laughs> yeah <I laughs> hey, whoever you were, wherever you are today, <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. Hey, fuck you, buddy. I, that hurt. <laughs> I was just standing there trying not to cry. <laughs> <laughs> I stopped the ball fully with my face. Oh no! Yeah, Why well, did you kick it at me? Yeah. You stopped it we're though. Playing There's so many doesn't... different directions. Yeah, you don't have to <laughs> kick it there. Kick it somewhere else. Well, it's That's... like when you're going down the street on like a skateboard and you see like a traffic cone. You're like, I can go anywhere except for into that traffic cone, and you just find yourself like drawn to it <laughs> inexorably. Like, you can't avoid it. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, it's I, the same thing. It's like uh, I, I broke my hand. The last time I played soccer was when I broke my hand because I was goalie, and this girl went to roundhouse kick the ball. No. no. And uh, instead, she, she roundhouse kicked my hand because mm. I was a goalie, and my job was to get the dang ball. And so I broke a few knuckles. Well, you, you kept God. her from getting the goal, though. Uh, at what cost? We well, really uh, risked it all playing like youth competitive <laughs> soccer and for what? Yeah, for me to do art. Yeah, yeah like I have bad ankles forever now. Y'all took, <laughs> took it way more seriously than I ever did. I played soccer through like middle school and then stopped. Yeah, and I mean, I mostly played in middle school, but I was in like a competitive league. I played as an adult. No, it wasn't fun. I wanted to play as an adult, but but even by the time I like finished high school, I was just like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, no. Well, I broke my hand, and I was like, thank God, it was my left hand. If I want to do art, uh, I should probably stop. Yeah, before doing art. before they get the money maker. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> before they take away the thing I care about. This is my. It was Ghost Dragon, right? Ghost Dragon. <laughs> this is okay, cool. Good. This is a Dark Souls boss. Lamp Terp. Lamp Terp. Lamp Terp. Lamp. It has Lamp like terp. a dumb name, and then it comes out, and you're terrified. <laughs> <laughs> Not Lamp Pert. Lamp Terp. Lamp Terp. Lamp Terp. Different. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, the Maryland alum appreciates the inclusion of Terp in the name. What does that mean? What does that mean? Our, our school our school mascot was the Terrapin, and we'd say Go Terps. Wow. So this is like if a bunch the of nerdy Marylanders had a had a land party be the land terps anyway um, <laughs> thank Julia, you. This, this rules thank yeah you for I like this my challenges my challenges three and <laughs> was that a Pokemon reference no it was just me <laughs> doing a weird voice <laughs> I don't know. This is Nathan's challenges three. It's <laughs> just my challenges three. Uh, don't be weird about Three it. Pokemon, six uh, types, one Drawfee episode. <laughs> <laughs> this is a real treat. I enjoyed uh, all of these designs and talking about Pokemon and how ugly some of them are. And you can uh, say Swampert playing <laughs> playing soccer in and our breaking. Years. Breaking bones. bones. No bones in this ghost. Just goop. 
Just Goop, Goop Ghost. Goop Ghost. If you like our Pokemon episodes and have ideas for other fun ways we can draw Pokemon or just any episode suggestions, you can leave them in the comments (laughs) down below. Or uh, if you want to get at us directly, you can support us on Patreon, which will get you access to the Drawfee Discord. And there's a whole channel in there where you can leave episode suggestions, which we check very regularly. I would also love to see fan art of <laughs> the uh, unevolved or evolved forms. I'm getting emotional. Oh, yeah, I hear your voice I get would, so like. I would like. I, I just love to see fan art. I just. Fan art. <laughs> you know, sometimes I think about fan art and I just get choked up. <laughs> Uh, we stream on Twitch. We have a store. Links in the description. Uh, we are sorry. We are so sorry. So sorry. I'm just. I'm sorry, Swampert. I'm not. <laughs> sorry. We were the sorry. We were the sorry. <laughs>